morning. I made it in to campsite just outside of Truckee last night. Made it in around 7.30, so it wasn't very late. Got everything set up. Nice little quiet lake here. One other person pulled up last night. Otherwise, quiet, very nice. Getting some morning movement in here. Getting a bit of a walk in. Check out the area. Got a couple of photos this morning. Truckee, looking very good. Love this out here. Super nice area. We got some, I'm not sure what fish are jumping in there, but beautiful morning though. So not a bad sleep considering as I was taking the mattress out of the truck, I put a hole in it. And so middle of the night, it deflated and we were sleeping on the ground. Just lovely. We're gonna get that patched up this morning and hopefully that solves that. Just couldn't patch it up last night because the glue on it takes so long to dry. So we'll see what we can do with that today. Great spot. We'll be back for sure. We're gonna continue on our way, head into Truckee quickly, get a coffee. And I think the plan is head towards Mount Shasta for the day. So let's go. We just crossed from Nevada to Northern California again. And we went through a checkpoint there. They were checking for fruits and vegetables, produce, that kind of thing. And then asking more questions about that. They confiscated our cherries. They took our cherries. We were allowed to keep our peaches, but they took our cherries. Luckily, there was only a few left. It's a very nice gentleman though. A couple minutes of questions and we were on our way. California just showing your spiciness here. We stopped at Honey Lake and this is usually a lake all here but it's not now. It's all dried up so in the summer it dries up to 12 square kilometers. It becomes an alkal alkali flat so that's everything you're seeing behind me there. 10 30 a.m. here. It's like 26 degrees Celsius almost 30 degrees Celsius already. So usually in the winter there would be a full lake here and now there's pretty much nothing. A little pit stop here on our way to Mount Shasta. 32 degrees now. It's like 12.30 in the afternoon. Just pulled off the highway from this dirt road here. Quiet spot, stretch our legs, get some fresh air, get some of this beautiful sun over 30 degrees so it is hot. I saw a good opportunity for something up here so we're gonna turn around and check it out. On this Northern California Highway 89 and uh, it's pretty quiet and we saw this really cool stretch of road that was one of those like iconic photos of the rolling hills and the rolling highway and it was completely empty so we stopped to snap a couple photos uh, I might drop a couple of those into the video here or you can check out my Instagram and I'll link it below where you can see those photos Um, oh, it's just 
check it out over here quickly. Found a cool spot. Put the river down here. Can't camp here, but we can camp close by. So we'll have some fun here for the day. Put a hole in that mattress last night as I was getting it out of the truck. So we've got a mission now to get it patched up so we can sleep on a mattress with air in it tonight. Let's see how the process goes. So this one is considered a large puncture or cut. So by golly, we're gonna be here for four hours getting this thing going. Found a watering hole. Trinity, Shasta Trinity Forest, National Forest. And still about 32 degrees Celsius out there. Woo! Oh yeah. Well, if we forgot our dinner, we got little crabs here. Look at this guy on the rock there. Got the moon up there behind us. This beautiful sunset. Let's find a place to sleep. Almost 6,600 feet now. It's 7 a.m. 